now let's learn how can we run this default web api project to run this web api project we need to use one more command that is provided by dotnet so let's type dotnet space then run and press the enter button now you can see the application is running at two urls so here is https localhost 5001 and we have 500 you can open any one of the link in the browser and you will see a proper working application so let's copy the url open a browser and in this browser you can enter this url press enter button now you can see we are getting a 404 error but do not worry in the url you need to append swagger and press enter again this time you can see we have some beautiful ui and in this ui we have a couple of information this is the name of my project this is the version of swagger swagger is also an api client tool we can use this swagger to test our apis if you are using the default project of web api then swagger is installed by default in the project here are the details of all the apis that are available in this project so we have only one api the type of api is get this is the url if i click on this one then you will see there are no parameters this is the description of this particular api 